Hi guys, welcome to US Educate Academy. Thanks for connecting with us. Today in this video, we are going to see the exact method to add social sharing buttons or share buttons to your blogger website for 100% free. And this tutorial is for beginners and for intermediaries who are doing blogs using Blogspot in order to get a maximum audience or a traffic monthly or daily so this button will generate automatic traffic so if a viewer click your button they will be redirected to uh, to the social media and they can share your post and you will get enough of traffic for monthly or weekly so now let's jump into it So we are beginning with opening of our web browser and now let's add social sharing button with a free tool named add this and uh, now I'm going to search for add this in Google and uh, here in the first uh, result uh, Google shows me as add this and now uh, you can simply click on dashboard so we can create like this uh, widgets or sharing buttons which are more likely and attractive so people who view your blog will uh, absolutely click your sharing buttons and you will get an additional traffic to your website so you can simply click here get started for free or you can simply click on dashboard in order to sign in so as I am having an account already it, it shows me you can sign in so if I uh, click on get started so I can simply sign up for my website so uh, for my app and uh, I can proceed with Google so so now uh, I'm gonna click on dashboard in order to enter my at this dashboard so in the dashboard as a first step now I'm gonna to proceed to tools and here now I'm gonna click on add new tool so in the add new section first of all I need to select my tool so what are the tools here share buttons follow buttons related posts website tip jar and uh, link promotion and list building so in this process we need a share button to be selected so now I'm gonna select a share button so in this share button now it says me as floating in order to select a floating or an inline or an expanding or expanding means you can simply uh, view this like this so or the image sharing or the pop-up window so now I'm gonna select the most common and the best one uh, in the world which is the floating one so we can simply view our uh, mobile view too so now I'm gonna select this floating bar so now I'm gonna click on continue and now let's uh, select which services we need to add to this floating bar so let's click on select by you and uh, now I'm gonna remove the email one and I'm gonna keep the Pinterest and I'm gonna add a service like LinkedIn or oh, so now I'm gonna remove the LinkedIn one so I can add uh, whatsapp so which are most popular social media platforms so I can re rearrange this simply by proceeding like this so now I have successfully arranged my sharing services so now I want to proceed to the next step here which is the design so I can select or I can change the design to white or gray or, or black or custom or I can select it as it is so now uh, I'm gonna select the icon color as white so I'm gonna select the style as bordered or I can select as standard so now I'm gonna place it as standard because this will look pretty good so now I'm gonna proceed to the share con uh, 
uh, counters so now i'm going to click on none and uh, i don't need any counters for my website so now uh, i'm going to uh, see where they are to place or the position on desktop and mobile so now i'm going to place in the mobile as hide so in order to hide in the mobile view and i will place in my desktop view only so to mobile view i will add inline uh, sharing buttons so now i'm going to proceed to the last step so now i'm going to click on activate tool in order to activate my tool so successfully saved tool so we have successfully saved our tool so as the next step now i'm going to proceed to the get the code option so here it says p get the code and this needs a little code to do its thing follow the instruction below to install it on your site and start using so now i'm going to click on uh so i'm going to click on code only view and i can simply click on this button to copy my code so now i'm going to i have copied my code so it says me as at this needs a little code to do its uh, thing so follow the instruction below so let's turn off this in order to see what we should do so it says me as paste the above code right above the closing body tag so now i'm going to paste my code in the closing body tag so my i have reached to the uh, block spot so now i'm going to select my website and uh, now i'm going to proceed to the team section and uh, now i'm going to click on edit html and uh, now i'm going to place the cursor anywhere in this area and i'm going to uh, press control plus f and now i'm going to enter as closing body so as you guys can see i have entered it so now i'm going to place my code below this level so now i'm going to paste my code over here so now i'm going to click on paste and i'm going to click on save so now as you guys can see this says me as processing so this update is successful so now we have successfully pasted our code in our website so now let's proceed to our website motivationallogy.blogspot.com so so now as you guys can see my sharing buttons are appearing successfully so now i can simply click on any of these in order to share my buttons so you guys can simply see uh, i can share my buttons over here so you guys can see uh, the api is connecting all of my social media accounts and i can share my blog so you can exclude pages too so now i'm going to place uh, in all the pages uh, this button so this would be more preferable by view, view users or viewers and they will they can share it directly by clicking this button so now uh, i'm going to proceed again to the at this and i'm going to click on my site and i'm going to proceed to my site and i'm going to click on tools and i'm going to click on add new tool in order to add a new tool so now i'm going to click on share buttons and i'm going to click on or oh, select the inline one and i'm going to click on continue and now i'm going to select my own uh, own social media accounts so now i'm going to again enter as whatsapp and now i'm going to use this one for desktop and uh, pc so so as you guys can see now i have add this so now i'm going to proceed to the second step and uh, now i'm going to keep it as it is so i'm going to proceed to the total and i'm going to click on none and i'm going to hide on this device so now i'm going to select the neither one and uh, now i'm going to click on activate tool so now i'm going to again press the code only and i'm going to copy this code and i'm going to paste this uh, below my first code so now i'm going to paste this so it's processing and the update is successful 
So now let's try to refresh our page. And now let's proceed inside our blog post. So now, as you guys can see, uh, my uh, these sharing buttons are from my team, so it's interfering with it. So you guys can simply customize your theme, or here after installing this code, you can simply copy this code and you can uh, edit the post code here over here. And you can simply select this code and you can simply proceed to the HTML view and you can uh, add above the all content or below all the content so it's your wish so you can add this one and you can simply click on update and you can refresh in order to see the inline uh, sharing button so as you guys can see you can see the inline sharing button appearing over here so we have successfully placed our uh, sharing buttons in uh, our blogger website for 100 percent free so that's it for this video please like share and subscribe us educate academy youtube channel for more video tutorials like this see you in the next one